hey y'all. Wait, hold on. Let me erect this a little bit. Okay. Period. Okay. Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. It's Queen to say, as you all may know. If you don't know, then now you know, okay? So, I just want to do a quick, you know, PSA message. I want to thank everybody who has been subscribing to my channel. Y'all don't even know it makes me so happy. Like, I've been wanting to do this for a really long time, and I'm just like, yeah, fuck it. So, and I've been getting hella love, too. So, yeah, welcome to the new, welcome to the new people to the channel, okay? We finna have a good time and a long time, period. So, yeah, that's out the way, all right? So today I have a message for the Capricorns, okay? Just a reminder that I could be saying you, it could be them, I could be saying she, it could be he, okay? Put the roles where they resonate, take what leaves, and leave. I said take what leaves. So fall season could be significant, okay? But take what resonates and leave what doesn't, all right? Capricorns, Captain Corns, Capri Suns. All right, let's see what's going on with the energy. What's going on with the Capricorn stain right off the bat? We got the High Priestess here. So, right off the bat, okay, I feel like there are some Capricorns out here who their gifts, their intuition, okay, your psychic abilities are really, really heightening at this time. Like, I feel like, I don't know, all these retrogrades and things of that nature, all right, they have put things into a certain perspective okay making you go back and like realizing certain things how strong how strong situations were or like thinking of old conversations old things that you mentally had took a note of okay but you're putting the pieces back together and you like damn like i already predicted that or damn i said this was gonna happen or you know what i'm saying you just like recognizing your true power like what your intelligence your emotional intelligence at that okay i feel like you got you on some self-mastery type shit like you just reading people you read you reading people they write that's what i'm picking up okay so we got the knight of pentacles here clarify the knight of pentacles clarify the knight of pentacles Holy spirit i hate when cards fall y'all know that Okay, yeah, we got Ten of Swords. So, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Swords. Okay. Let me see. Clarify the Ten of Swords. Five of Wands. Okay, so this is this is some people who y'all not necessarily on the best of terms with. Okay, there, there's some immature people. Okay, these people could have backstabbed you, okay? Been in competition with you, okay? Try to um one up you in a situation, okay? Trying to be in competition with you, but I'm hearing you don't compete where you don't compare. We got the two of cups at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so I feel like this this is a situation to whereas you you looking back at all the people that try to play you. Literally with this Knight of Pentacles here, they wouldn't focus on positive things, okay? They they not focusing on progress, okay? They got you got the ten of swords here, okay. So ten of swords and the five of swords together, okay. This is heavy, like it backfired. Some shit backfired, okay. Motherfuckers was backstabbed, it backfired, okay. Some there could have been friend groups trying to gang up on you, or this could have been a lover, family members. Really, I'm picking up a heavy friend groups, okay. Two cup energy, but yeah, they're getting justice for the situation, okay. That like Libra energy. Yeah, like, they're getting heavy burdens placed upon them, okay? While you're just literally minding your business, okay? I feel like your third eye chakra is opening as well. Something about tissue here. You may need to go uh, get you a, a new roll of tissue. You finna roll out soon. I said, why did I say roll out? Right out? I mean, yeah, what am I saying? Anyway, I'm gonna skip past that. But yeah, you might need to get to, to get you some tissue, okay? You don't want to be on the toilet and then 
<laughs> you can't wipe your ass. I don't know why I had to say that, but it just was coming through heavy. Okay, anyway, back to the reading. We got the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, so this lets me know, like, motherfuckers, they don't have no hustle. They ain't got no grind, okay? This is people that sleep in until 3, 4, 5 in the afternoon and then come complain and upset because they don't know why you're getting further in life than them. But that's because you over there focusing on yourself, okay? I feel like some of you Capricorns also been meditating more or you need to meditate more, okay? This will heighten your intuition, heighten your psychic abilities if you have that. Yeah, we have an attack and stand your ground here, okay? We got the seven of wands. So these people could have tried to physically attack you, verbally, mentally attack you, okay? But the eye of Ra, I look at this Hierophant card, like the eye of Ra, like they, God seen everything and he's going to make you a trophy in front of your enemies, okay? I feel like you're going to be getting rewarded everything that was taken from you, stolen from you, okay? Let's see, clarify the eight of pentacles. In reverse, please. Clarify the any pinnacles in reverse. Clarify the any pinnacles in reverse. The magician. So I look at I'm looking at this like a few ways, okay? So even either you find out, you intuitively find out who was playing in your face with this magic shit. Like I feel like y'all y'all be trying to give people the benefit of the doubt, okay? But truly, you don't really know what people do behind closed doors, okay? You think they in there working with this Eight of Pentacles energy, but it's in reverse, okay? Somebody here is trying to manifest, the, manifest you being in their position, okay? Somebody wants to take your light, your shine, and your destiny. Somebody also here is playing with black magic, okay, or a low-level form of magic, okay, regarding towards your money. It could even be just wishing bad upon you, okay, giving you evil eye, okay, talking down upon you about your project, product, project, whatever that you do, okay, trying to one-up you in a sense, all right? So that's that. I'm also picking up that they they can't, man, they don't, they're upset about how they can't manifest. Yeah, we got the Princess of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Like, it's only one you. Like, I feel like they trying to cop, like, do something the way that you do it. And it just, it, it don't work. Knight of Pentacles, Two of Swords, Five of Wands, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Something ain't working. Like, they're not getting, no, you're not, you're not, that's literally not working. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Something ain't working. Okay, somebody even maybe even tried to use magic here, literally. Okay, hoodoo, hoodoo, whatever. Okay, but they're upset because they can't cannot imitate you with this Princess of Swords card at the bottom of the deck. They can't imitate you. They can't be you. They can't shine the light that you shine, can perform. And it's almost a sense to where as it, it upsets them. They really do. Yeah, we got the world card here, okay? So, like, y'all on the move, okay? Could be even planning a travel trip, okay? Could be for a friend celebration or, I don't know, get together, family. The holidays are coming up, okay? But we got the world card here. Could be dealing with a, a Leo Aries. I mean, a Leo Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio. I think that's the fixed signs, okay? But we got an Eight of Swords here at the bottom of the deck, all right? So let's see. Clarify the world card here. Okay, so I feel like motherfuckers got caught up being messy. You caught them, okay? What's new? That's gonna happen, especially when you psychic, you, you, you read. I feel like y'all read the fuck. I just feel like y'all read somebody they rights. And they ain't like it. The world card of seven of cups. So they they want they want they don't want you to believe in your power. They don't want you to believe in the manifesting that you can do. They don't want you to believe that you'll be able to get this this opportunity. Okay, they don't want you to look at the thing at the cup as half full versus half empty. Okay, they don't they want you to believe that it's just so hard to just just come up out of, come up, come from nothing and do what it is that y'all, that y'all got going on now. 
Okay, I also feel like this is some people that you knew back in the past, okay, that you no longer in communication with, or you could be in communication with them. But I feel as though these whoever this is, this situation, I feel as though they didn't want you to leave them. First of all, escape. Okay, they you're the one that got away, energy. They didn't want you to leave them, first of all. They also didn't want you to really leave, take off, like leave them behind in the dust. So this is what they're going to try to do. They're going to try to feed you all these cups, okay? Oh, I love you. Oh, family is this, family is that. Oh, I was there with you since this and this, this and that. And yada, yada, you just like, well, I'm getting the fuck away from y'all. Like, I ain't six of swords energy. Like, I'm literally gonna get on the boat, drive the boat, and get the fuck on, okay? Clarify the seven of cups. Yeah, the fool. Like, you you literally taking leaps of faith, okay? You, you, you're you the risk taker here. And I feel like they want to put you down in, in a sense, okay? Or make you feel bad for leaving them behind. Or just trying to paint this picture out to you, to multiple different people, okay, about something. There, Somebody's upset about something here. Okay, but y'all definitely are traveling soon, okay? I'm here to pay, watch, pay attention to, like, when you book and stuff, make sure you put in the right dates, make sure you, you know, yada, 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 okay? This could even be for business, okay? Or you could be taking part in something when you're traveling, with the full car here but what is the cycle some cycle is complete as well all right and i don't feel like you yeah ace of pentacles at the bottom of the deck there's there's a new opportunity here okay so you could be moving for work or you're just literally traveling okay you manifested this that's what you're not understanding like something you have maybe you've been going through a lot of capricorn and you like why is something working but i feel like something is going to come in so abundantly for you like yeah, we got the Empress and the Ace of Pentacles. Like, your fruit, it's going to be a, a very fruitful fall season, literally. Like, you manifested a lot of shit, okay? Yeah, that's what I like. I like good readings. We got, I guess we could have to get the negative shit out the way first, okay? But everything that's coming towards you, okay, you manifested, manifested this with this fool's energy, okay? Something is starting over here. All right. Yeah, we got the Six of Pentacles in reverse. I don't know if this came in reverse, but fuck it. I'm going to take it, okay? So, let me see. Clarify. Yeah, with the Hermit card at the bottom of the deck, I feel like you're just giving back to yourself at this time. You're no longer just overpouring into other people. I feel like you're just pouring back into yourself at this time, which is, okay, That's it's not a bad thing to do, okay? I always say there's two types of selfish, okay? There's a selfish... When you just trying to take about take from people you don't care about nobody but yourself, and then there's a selfish when you're helping yourself, and you gotta take a step back from other people, places, and things. Okay, so clarify the six of pentacles. We got the nine of wands. Okay, so I feel like God was testing you or whoever you know you resonate with, source, the universe, whatever. I feel as though God has been testing you, okay? I feel like God has been giving you lump sums of whatever that you you have been asking for, okay? Let's say that it's money. I feel like you've been, you've been fucking it all up, okay? Each time and then it just sent you back, okay? And I feel like you finally started to like see shit for what it is with this high priestess energy first, first popping out, okay? You 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 already know what's going on, okay? And it, and you know if you keep helping these people, you keep gifting, okay? And I give it to yourself. You will come across many many tests, okay? You will have roadblocks. You will have challenges, okay? You don't want to keep going forward. Just take the step back, okay? I'm also hearing spirit tell you like you can't make a house in one day, okay? You gotta let that thing brick by brick. Brick by brick, piece by piece. And if you got people to come in and take your pieces or your bricks as you laying them. It's, a house is never going to be built. A foundation is never going to be built. And I feel like you're understanding that with this two of wands card, the strength card here as I split the deck. Okay, you're gaining that strength. You're, you're harnessing that power, okay? You're looking forward to the journey, okay? You're, you're, you're understanding that it's happening for you, okay? Not to you, all right? And you're learning and intuitively seeing 
how things have held you back, things that you should move away from, okay? And you realize that who was who been wishing bad upon you the whole time, okay? It was all in your face plan, like, you know, they fuck with you and they want you to win the whole time. You don't. You got the Knight of Swords energy. Okay, clarify the Knight of Swords. Knight of Wands energy. Okay, so I feel like you've been you've been feeling like you in this low position. Like you don't have that much rank or you overlooked with this situation, okay, regarding your business and how smart you are. But we got the Ten of Cups here, okay? So I feel like you're going to be at peace with, with what comes towards you, okay? I feel like you were hidden in plain sight and you were protected, okay? And you were overlooked, okay? God's rejection. Rejection is God's protection. And with this not a sword's energy and this not a one's energy, I feel like you felt like you were in your initial phases, but truthfully, you learned all that you have to know, like, and you moving up to the next level in life, okay? You guys also may be welcoming your own family, but it's, I feel as though people go by age, but I feel like you as an individual, I feel like you have a lot of emotional intelligence. You have physical intelligence. Okay, you also have these brainstorms of ideas. You just don't know how to put them into gear. Okay, with all these that be happening around you. Ooh, I just, I just did that, didn't I? <laughs> okay, we'll clarify the other swords and it's not a wise energy. So I feel like things have been moving slow for you, okay? You may not be the type of person to express yourself or how you feel about certain situations or go for your business opportunities, but I feel like that will be changing. Yeah, you have this newfound love for something. You, This could be you, a, another person, a business idea, whatever, okay? Some of you guys may be chefs in here, okay? But you have this newfound love for something, okay? It's a cup. A cup of love is here, but I'm not sure what this is. Okay, clarify. I feel like you have to just love yourself first and get to this this stage to where you know can't shit focus, you can't shit tear you down, can't nobody there's nothing nobody can say about you or nothing like that. Yeah, so something is in, is in this beginning this beginning stages here, okay. But I, I see progress. I definitely see progress. I feel like you feel as though you got to get more in tune with something. You got to get more passionate with something. But I feel like something is already here in order for you to just jump and do it. But you Capricorn being Capricorns, like you want to have your, you, you, you over it and you over crossing your, your I's and your T's. And it's just like, okay, you, you doing all this research, you doing all this work, you doing all this, but when are you going to actually do it? Because it ain't going to never get off the ground, like I said, unless you actually do it. So I feel like you gained your confidence Okay, you gain your wisdom about situations. You learn it every day as you grow, okay? Whether this be about, it could be about any situation. You can literally apply this to anything. Whether this is this is school, okay? This is this is about money, business opportunities, okay? This can even be about kids, okay? Slowly, slowly learning how to become a parent, okay? Slowly learning how to transition into being a parent. Whatever, you could literally apply it to your life, okay? But something came out here. Something was clearly revealed to you. Um, whatever the situation is, okay? Um, I feel like you, you realize, like, who you are as a person and what you no longer want to include yourself in. And I feel like you, you realize, like, who you truly are and that you're just not to be fucked with. Like, you literally one of a kind. And if they're not handling you gently, it's that King of Swords energy, like... All right, now I got to turn on my masculine side, okay? And literally break this shit down to how this finna go. And you resting with that. You resting with your decision. You resting with your, like I said, six cups, six pinnacles in reverse. You're, you're giving back to yourself. You resting, you recharging. And yeah, so I feel like it's, it's moving good for you. All right, I'm going to get one more card and then we're going to end the reading, okay? Keep the cord. We got the emperor, okay, for energy, okay. This big CEO, this 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 masculine energy, okay. I feel like you taking charge, okay. I feel like you are using your authority, literally, okay, and getting some some stuff done on you. You're expressing your authority, okay, your position, and how you gonna fit in other people's lives and how they're gonna fit in your lives, okay. What you have time for and what you're willing to put your your you know your energy into, okay. And I feel like this is gonna be good for you, okay. You you literally like. 
I'm this emperor. I'm this empress. Like this could even you could even be meeting your twin flame because the em empress card was out earlier. Okay, but you just embodying the CEO energy and taking charge. Okay, taking your power back. Most importantly, so it's looking good for you, Capricorn. Okay. So keep doing what you're doing. Okay, keep focusing on you. Keep focusing on that bag. And everything will work out fine, okay? So if this video resonated, please give me a like, a share, a comment, okay? And make sure you turn on that bell notification so you can be notified every time I post another video. And I will see y'all in the next one. Bye, Capricorn.